Hello everyone, this is part four of my haul. Now, I meant to show this one in the last part, but I accidentally forgot to. This is the Tim Holtz, the um, Holiday Pass collection. This one's really cute. I picked it up at Tuesday morning. There we go. Let's see. Focus in. There we go. And um, I'm not going to show the paper because I noticed that when I show the paper, my camera tends to bounce. So I don't like how that looks. So I figured I'll stay away from that. Okay, and this came from Joann's. I picked up the Mister. They only had one available, so this was with their big sale when it was like 50% off with the additional. Um, my husband is military, so we got the additional 20% off. Where is she? I got, sorry if you hear my daughter in the background, the Teresa Collins, the newer one. What is the name of this one? Music Sheet. Oh, you're going to help me? Yeah. Okay, you can hand them to Mommy. Thank you. I got one water brush because that's all that they had. They had no other water brushes. And I have the Distress marker, so I figured I would use that on that. And then they had, hold on one second, honey. They had these sponge daubers. Um, they only had these packs, so I picked up two of them. I also got the mini misters because I use these like crazy too. So I picked up a few more. Now they were basically all out of supplies already, so I can only pick up a few things of each. And then they were clearancing out some stickers. So I found these ones from Kane Company, and these ones were so cute, so I picked yeah. these up. Actually, my daughter threw them in there, and then I saw them, and I thought, oh, they're really cute, so I picked them up. Okay. Bye. And then these were also on clearance. These are like the ones that have the glitter in them, and then they shake around. They're kind of like the snow globe effect one. So I picked one of those up. That whole entire section was basically cleared out already, and I went early in the sale. Um, I needed more of these because I don't have too many blocks, so I picked these ones up. It has the two different sizes, and these are by the Ink and Dink and Do. Sorry, my daughter's like rushing me through this. No, 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 don't throw. Keep them right here, okay? Yeah. I do not have a Versa mark, so I picked one up, and I've seen these on tons of videos, and they seem to be really great, so I figured I'd try one out. Because I've been using Big Juicy for years, and that thing has never dried up on me. But, I noticed that some papers, it doesn't hold well. Um, I also got the variety pack of the refill. So, this one has the Memento Tuxedo Black, the Stays On Jet Black, and the Versamark refills. So, it's got the three packs, and I picked this up. I also work a lot with acrylic albums, and I have fallen in love with acrylic albums, so I was using my glossy accents, and I wanted to try this, because I've heard really great things about using this on your, your acrylics, so I'm going to try this next. I also bought some, it's like a cheesecloth, it says it's a sanding dust cloth, um, I started doing the mixed canvases, so I picked some of that up for that, and you know, I raided, <laughs> I raided the kitchen already and stole all that, and we used to have a Sweet Bay by us, which is a grocery store, and they closed down, and they were the only ones that had it, so now I have to find out where else they sell it for the kitchen. Um, I also got, because it was 40% off, I got the um, Tim Holtz, this one is the Pocket Watches and Steampunk set, because I did not have that one. So I figured I'd pick that one up. I got the enamel accents, the black and the white one. I wanted to try that, see how it was. Because I love regular glossy accents, so I wanted to see if that was just as awesome. Can you be patient, honey? I got Distress Ink and Tumbled Glass. You want to look? I got the Peel Paint. It. Oh, you want you gotta do it here. This is where you gotta go. I got wild honey. Thank you so much. I also got the big um, alphabet set. This one is block talk alphabet, and this one is huge. I mean, it's massive. So I picked this one up because that was forty percent off. Oh, don't mess with that, okay? 
I got myself a um, enlarged bossing crease mat thing because I have been needing this. Um, I have a lot of spellbinders dies and I need to, you know, use it for the edging. I can't think of what it's called right now, but you know, when you put it on and it embosses it basically. Sorry about that. Sorry, about that. Sorry. Okay, I also got some stamps over here. I know my daughter's handing me things too, so this is making it harder. The Teresa Collins, this one is the baby. And one of my good friends is about to have a baby right now, so I'm going to make her a mini album. I got her baby shower in like a week that I got to get ready for. This one is Christmas. This one's got the postcard on it, the miniature one, the tree. So that one was adorable. You got to keep them here, okay? Here's another Christmas one. And this one is called Holiday Oops, Frolic. Sorry, I'm not exactly near my hand right now, so. And then I got the All That Glitters. This one's got really cute stuff. Love the snowman. Can you put that right there? Thank you. This one is Girly Posh. And this one is another Teresa Collins one. I thought that was so cute. And I got the um, Hero Arts, the cupcake one. And not all the Joanne's carries this. I noticed that. So, I saw that one in... Picked it up. I have um, been eyeing this for a long time. It's got the variety pack of the smaller embossing powders. So I picked those up. Because it gives me a little bit more of a range than what I already own. I picked up the um, carpet out of the corner chomper because the one that I have is horrible. It's a little handheld one and I'm telling you that little stinker is so hard to press that I've been wanting this for a long time. <laughs> so I picked that up. I also picked up the, um, what is the name of this punch? Let's see. The Flourish's Wave and this is a 2-in-1. I thought this one was so cute so I want to try that out. Oh my god, we can't turn back. What? We can't go back. Hey, watch it. Sorry. Two year olds and the things that they say. I have the um, Stampin' Up! the dress um, die that they came out with and everything. So I picked these up because, um, yeah, I love to do creations with that. And these were perfect for it. So these are the Tim Holtz little um, hangers. Oh, don't break that. Uh-oh. You're breaking it. Be careful. I used up my last one, so I picked up more of the um, book plates from Tim Holtz. I picked these up because I didn't have any of these, so I wanted to get some. I have the felt ones, but I don't have these ones. The sponge applicators, so I picked that up. Um, I wanted to make a binder, so I am going to like make like a mini album binder, so I picked these up. And then my Glossy Accents is about halfway out, so I picked up a backup. Everything was super cheap, 50% off basically, and then um, with that extra 20% off, I couldn't beat it, so that's why I stocked up. Come on, you need to be a good girl, okay? This is one that I've been looking at for a long time, and only one of the Joann's near me, near me has it. So I picked this up, which is the Pansy Punch Around the Page by Martha Stewart. I bought the starter kit, so this is my second one to the starter kit of that um, circle. I like to make them as doilies and put them on my scrapbook layouts. And this one is the Flower Arches. So I picked that one up. Can you move? I need to get to that paper stack. Thank you. I picked up the Juniper Berry Stack from DCWV. This one was such a pretty stack. I picked up the small little glitz one to add on to my scrapbook for my um, wedding album. I picked up the heavy duty pack of the um, paper, the world tour 
from the coordinations lines at Joann's. This thing, oh my goodness, great. But I will tell you this, when I try to use it on my Cricut mat, it sucks to my Cricut mat. And it was horrible and I had to scrub it and scrub it off to get it off. I don't know why, but I won't try this paper on my Cricut no more. And then I got this one and the Parisian Nights. They had these on clearance, the um, pearl sheets. So they were only $2.97 and I think that they actually let me use the 20% off on top of that. So I got these for super dirt cheap and they really have a great shine to them. I don't know if you can see that. They were beautiful. So I got them in the, what's the what is it, pearl color. And then I got one in the, or two in the black. And I thought that I had picked up a pink one, but apparently I didn't. So I got two whites, two pinks. You need to um, hold your drink. Yes? Mm -hmm. You can't do that. You're going to spill all over the carpet. That's not good. Um, This one is the glitz one. This one has super shine. So I picked these up. I picked two of them up because they were like, what, eight bucks? So... <laughs> I picked those up from originally from 20 here. I'll show better. I know. I'm sorry. I'm trying to also, you know, have my daughter calm down and relax. There's 24 of them. And the last thing that I picked up from Joann's was the cinnamon luster stuff. You want the drink? Then drink it. Stop trying to spill it on my carpet. That's all. You're welcome. And that was the last that I got from Joann's. All right, stay continued to watch part, I believe it's four. All right, thank you. Bye.